Among the biggest explosions of radio energy in the entire universe, they generate more energy than a billion suns. The energy and radio frequencies are so great that eventually, the entire universe will be aware of this one explosion. Breaking news from the cosmos. The James Webb Space Telescope, our eye into the universe's deepest secrets, has made a terrifying discovery. Betelgeuse, a star renowned for its luminous presence in our night sky, has shown signs of an impending supernova event in 2023. But as we grapple with the implications of such a stellar spectacle, a shocking revelation from the past emerges. The enigmatic supernova SN 1987A. Could the secrets of this past explosion hold the key to understanding Betelgeuse's fate? And what might the consequences be for our very own planet? Join us as we journey into the heart of this cosmic mystery. The James Webb Space Telescope has been at the forefront of astronomical discoveries since its launch. Its advanced instruments and unparalleled infrared capabilities have allowed it to peer into the farthest reaches of the universe, revealing secrets that have long eluded us. One of its most recent and concerning discoveries revolves around the star Betelgeuse and its supernova event in 2023. What's this startling revelation that the JWST has just uncovered? Let's find out. But before we get into the mysteries surrounding Betelgeuse, it's essential to understand the significance of another monumental event in the world of astronomy, the explosion of SN 1987A. This supernova serves as a crucial reference point, offering insights into the life cycles of massive stars and the dramatic ends they meet, helping us understand the mysterious behavior of stars like Betelgeuse. Recently, the telescope's near-infrared camera captured a detailed image of the supernova SN1987A, revealing its intricate structure. But this supernova was first observed in 1987 when astronomers witnessed one of the brightest stellar explosions in the night sky. Since its discovery, astronomers have been closely monitoring its expanding debris to gain insights into the processes of stellar evolution. The SN1987A supernova, resulting from the violent aftermath of a giant star's demise, is located 168,000 light years away in the Large Magellanic Cloud, a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way. This supernova emits a wide range of electromagnetic radiation, from radio waves to gamma rays. It has been previously studied using renowned observatories such as NASA's Hubble and Spitzer Space Telescopes and the Chandra X-ray Observatory. However, the introduction of the James Webb Space Telescope has provided an unprecedented view of this iconic supernova. The telescope's near-infrared imager captured the most. Detailed images of the supernova, showcasing its equatorial and outer rings, crescent shape, inner ejector, and a unique keyhole structure. The center of the image displays dense clusters of gas and dust released by the stellar explosion. This dust is so dense that even the near-infrared light detected by the JWST can't penetrate it, resulting in the dark hole in the keyhole. Surrounding the inner keyhole is a Luminous equatorial ring formed by debris ejected tens of thousands of years before the supernova explosion. This ring also contains glowing hotspots that developed when the supernova shock wave collided with the structure. The JWST sensitivity also revealed new crescent-shaped structures believed to be part of the supernova explosion's outer layers of gas. While neutron stars typically form after a supernova explosion, the one in SN1987A remains elusive, primarily due to its dense core. This explosion likely symbolizes the death of a blue supergiant star, one of the most massive and luminous stars in the universe. So, as we've seen with SN1987A, the universe is full of unpredictable phenomena. Now Betelgeuse might just be the next cosmic enigma to shock us all. Are we on the brink of witnessing another stellar spectacle, one that could rival or even surpass the awe of SN1987A? NASA astronomers are on the edge of their seats because they've stumbled upon a revelation that has sent ripples through the scientific community. Betelgeuse, known for its consistent brightness, began to dim. This wasn't a gradual dimming that one might expect from a star nearing the end of its life. It was sudden, noticeable, and concerning. Observations from JWST showed that the star's brightness had decreased significantly in a short span. But what could cause such rapid dimming? Betelgeuse is not just any star. It's a behemoth. Its diameter is about 900 times that of our sun, and if placed at the center of our solar system, its outer surface would extend beyond the orbit of Jupiter. Such massive stars have short lifespans, and their deaths are explosive, often resulting in supernova. These explosive events are not only mesmerizing, but also crucial for the universe as they scatter elements essential for life as we know it. 
In essence, the death of stars like Betelgeuse contributes to the birth of life elsewhere. Is it possible that a massive star like Betelgeuse could simply fade away without a dramatic exit? The answer is both intriguing and complex. Several theories were proposed to explain this phenomenon. One popular theory suggested the presence of dust clouds in front of the star, obscuring its light and causing the dimming effect. As stars like Betelgeuse age, they often shed their outer layers, releasing vast amounts of dust and gas into space. This material can form dense clouds that can, at times, block the star's light, leading to perceived dimming from our vantage point. In fact, recent observations have shown that Betelgeuse has been releasing an increased amount of material, leading to the formation of such dust clouds. This process is a natural part of a star's life cycle, especially for red supergiants like Betelgeuse. Another theory pointed to stellar pulsations. Massive stars like Betelgeuse often undergo periods of expansion and contraction. These pulsations can lead to variations in brightness, with the star dimming during contraction phases. This is not uncommon for stars of Betelgeuse's type. The star's immense gravity pulls its outer layers inward, causing it to contract, and then the heat from the core pushes them outward, causing it to expand. This rhythmic pulsation can lead to noticeable changes in brightness over short periods. But the most alarming theory, and one that has gained significant traction, is that this dimming could be a precursor to an impending supernova. Could we be on the brink of witnessing one of the most spectacular events in our cosmic neighborhood? The life cycle of a star is determined by its mass, and Betelgeuse, being 20 times the mass of our sun, has always been destined to end its life in a supernova explosion. The sudden dimming could be an indication that the star is running out of fuel and is about to collapse under its gravity. Historically, stars that have undergone sudden dimming events have at times exploded in spectacular supernova. These explosions are not only visually stunning, but also play a crucial role in the universe's evolution, dispersing essential elements into space. The JWST began its observations of Betelgeuse long before the supernova event, using its suite of advanced instruments, including the near-infrared camera, the mid-infrared instrument, and the near-infrared spectrometer. The JWST collected a plethora of data on Betelgeuse. These instruments allowed the telescope to capture high-resolution images, analyze the star's light, spectrum, and detect minute changes in its brightness and temperature. But with all this advanced technology, how did JWST actually see the changes in Betelgeuse leading up to the supernova? The type of data JWST collected about Betelgeuse is truly astounding. For instance, the mid-infrared instrument MIRI, with its ability to observe in the mid-infrared spectrum, could detect the heat emitted by the dust around Betelgeuse. This dust, a result of the star shedding its outer layers, can tell us a lot about the star's health and its imminent demise. By analyzing this dust and the light emitted from Betelgeuse, astronomers could piece together the star's recent history, its current state, and predict its future. Betelgeuse's enigmatic nature has always been a subject of fascination. Its sheer size and luminosity make it stand out, but it's the mysteries that surround this celestial body that truly captivate the imagination. For starters, Betelgeuse is a variable star. This means its brightness doesn't remain constant, but fluctuates over time. While many stars exhibit this behavior, Betelgeuse's variations are particularly pronounced. These fluctuations have been observed for over a century, and while they were initially thought to be regular, recent observations have shown them to be more erratic. This unpredictability adds another layer of intrigue to an already enigmatic star. But what causes these fluctuations? Well, this red supergiant is a bubbling cauldron of nuclear reactions. Deep within its core, hydrogen atoms fuse to form helium, releasing vast amounts of energy 